You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Thanks for stopping by today. Yes, you see the side of a box. Now, these originally did not come in this box, but I needed to do a what's in the box. I felt like doing that today, but I got these all together from one person. I found them at a local flea market, I think it was. It's been a while. I've had them for a while. And uh, I didn't pay much, which is really nice. And I thought, let's check them all out on video. I have tested one to try, and I was going to make a video of it, but then realized I could not get it to work exactly like it was supposed to. So here we go. What's in the box? I was walking around a flea market, and this seller had all of these and more. Some I already had. All handheld games from their kids or childhood. And I thought, well, this will be cool. Let me check them out. Some actually turned on. I've got 101 Dalmatians. Uh, this is the one I was working on. That's why the screw is out and the batteries. I can show you what's going on with the hit and miss. That's probably one of the oldest ones in this collection. Then this is called a hula hipster. This actually works. It clips onto your belt and you hula hoop and that's the game. You kind of spin this around and then based on the options and the type of game and the speed, it calculates the game. All right, so that is that one. And then this one here, I just thought, hmm, never seen it. Sonic Rally Race. Okay, it doesn't turn on, so let's see. All right, so we'll put some batteries in this one. I'm going to do a quick test of these. Now, handheld games. I probably have 100 plus and maybe only 50 are on video. This one looked really cool, and it works, too. You've got this spaceship, and this... Oh, I'll play it in a little bit. I'll show you that one. And then I saw this Dragon Ball Z, and I thought, yeah, I better grab that one. It looks like a unique game. Let's move that up there. And, of course, as soon as I saw Sonic 2 Hedgehog handheld from Sega, don't know if it works... Not sure yet. It was missing the battery compartment. That's what I remember about it. But I still grabbed it. Why not? And then this one. How could you pass this one up? It was Frogger. I didn't have it. Don't know about the batteries yet on that one. And the last one isn't necessarily a handheld, but it's a little maze game. The Game of Life maze game. And you have the cars that are in there, and you just kind of move them around. All right, so that's what I have for you today. Let's go one by one. I won't spend too much time on all of them. Because like I said, you haven't seen even a fraction of the handheld games. When I first started the channel, I was doing a lot of these. I'd grab a handheld, make a video, two minutes, three minutes, and then move on to the next one to try to get them all on video. And then at some point, I just lost track. All right, so let's check out Hit and Missile next. All right, game number one. I have it running. It's uh, Hit and Missile. Now this one here is, uh, well, it was easy to take apart. Two screws there, two screws on this part, and then four screws on the back. And then the cover lifts off. You have a counter here, which keeps track. And then your timer's up here, your on off. Now the game actually runs, it shoots missiles, but you don't get the strike here I will show you. You want the fire sound. So I can fire the missiles, and when they hit those targets on the ships, they are supposed to light up. Oh, oh, that was funny, right when I did that. And these are like film strips running through here, so I'll work on it more. I would like to make a video of just this one at some point. All right, so let me show you the Hula Hipster, because that one's all powered up and ready. Maybe I'll do the three that I know for sure are working and ready. So this one, like I said, there's a Hula Jam, Hyper Spin, and hip flip. The low and high is the volume. Okay, so now I got to, I printed out the instructions for this one. I wasn't sure if I was going to. So pretend like this is clipped on. Okay, and then you stop hula hooping. So this game has a forward and reverse. Okay, so I wiped out. So something in there. A little reset start. You gotta get that spin going on your hip. Started. Oh, I stopped. Let's see. Yeah. Stop it. Start it. Stop it. Started. 
So there's not much more to do it. I grabbed it because it just looked unique and interesting. So that is Hula Hipster. Now the life game, that one's easy to show you real quick. Uh, I think you're just getting your cars over here. I don't know if it's just one car, all the cars. It says safe route, risky road, the game of life. L limited gameplay. That's what it says right on there. So I did not print or find out any more about this one. There's not much more to it. All right, that is the game of life. I call it a handheld, but it is a type of handheld game. Now this one I really liked. I thought this was one of the cooler of all the games I played. I need to get my ship to the starting point. It's going the wrong way, so I gotta turn it around. I'm reversing it, so that's why I'm having a hard time. There we go. I need to get it to go. Oh, I missed it again. Hold on. Still going the wrong way. There we go. All right, so you bring your ship back to the start line right there. And then when I... Here, let me see if I can get a better angle down on this. I'll try not to pick it up. I know the lighting is tough when there's so much glare. Let's see. Let me turn the lighting down just a little and see if that helps in some way. Not much. It is a little hard to see through, but I think you're going to get it. So left turn, right turn. So you want to follow this by pressing left turn, right turn, left turn. So yeah, I did left, right there. Otherwise it would keep going around. Ah, uh, no nope. shortcut. Okay, that was my shortcut. I didn't get that one. That was the toughest one. Ah, too much. I think I went too far on that one, too. Ooh, shortcut. Ah. Continues to do that. I haven't figured out how to get past that part yet. Let's try it again here. Is that it's hard to see isn't it? Oh, 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 made it. Oh Ah, oh Aha, okay, so that It's a very interesting game. It is made in China 1991 from Soma. Not familiar with them. All right, let me grab a few more supplies now and the ones that I have not tested and put batteries in, let's check them out. All right, here we go. I have put the batteries in and uh, I have not turned them all on just yet. So we will see how they work. This one is running. So when I put the batteries in, it just started. Uh, so 101 Dalmatians and this one is 1990 Tiger Electronics. This took two AA batteries, and then you have off, sound, max score, on start. ACL is a clear, probably you gotta push a pin in there, something, or a little paper clip. Here we go, let's turn it on. So it says 9990 as the score. Well, we gotta start, all right, stage one. Let's see what's going on here. Hopefully you can see it. Let me turn this in. Okay, oh, so I am Ma and Pa of the dog Dalmatians. Now I'm hitting jump. I don't know what I'm jumping in. Is that what's take? Oh, take. My head goes down. Ooh, I just got a little shock or something. Okay, so I'm jumping hurdles, but I'm not sure about the take yet. There's things on this lower. Oh, I just fell in a hole. There's things on this lower level. I'm not sure. All right, let me focus here. Focus. I want to take something. I don't. Oh, a hole. I want to eat. Oh, missed that hole. Jump. There's a boost. What does that mean? It says speed. Maybe that was a take. Okay, I'm not doing too bad. Score 220. 240. Fell in a hole. Great. Jump. Jump. I mean, back in the day when you had one of these games, you were the coolest kid. 
Imagine that. Oh, I'm losing. I lose points. I didn't. Yeah, I'm losing points. All right, 110. Bad score. All right, turn that one off. All right, that one's pretty neat. Here is Sonic 2. Now, this one is missing the battery cover. Now, normally I wouldn't buy it if it didn't have the battery cover. 1989 Tiger, but anything Sonic, I grab. Okay, turn it on. I see zero score. There's an off sound pause on another ACL clear. Let's start. Let's see. Sorry if you're getting glare. It's always hard to look up there and look down there and play the game right. Oh, there he is. Okay, so I can run and jump. I see. Ooh, a loop. Oh, there I curled up in a little sonic ball. All right, this one would take some time. I have three. Oh, I gotta keep going forward. Okay, so I can't get up the loop. Obviously, I'm not doing the loop right. I'm going to give up on that one just because I'm not familiar with this handheld. That's why a lot of times I spend some time on them prior, but let's turn that one off. Okay, still cool. I'm still keeping it. Let's bring in Sonic Rally Race. On off. Sound? I got no sound. On off. Oh, pause, start. This is a Radio Shack. Uh, I don't see a year. Not in this section here. Maybe it's on the front. No. This is the only one that took triple A's. So here we go. Let's pause, start. There. Okay, I get it now. Pause, start. Sound. Ah, a side, a left to right. Ooh, hit. I crashed. I crashed. I don't want to crash. Boost. Going left. Ooh, he switched lanes on me. Ooh, a lot going on here. Oh, oh. all right. That one's pretty neat. Still fun to check out. That's why I like to check these out. And then Dragon Ball Z, not familiar with this one. This one is MGA. Now I've got a bunch of their games. 1999 MGA. And then this was on a second ago. So this one auto turns off. Start attack. It looks like a fighting game, so I'm mode sound. Mode sound. Oh, there we go. Start. I'm down here in the left corner, hard to see. Oh, I can kick. Ooh, kick, 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 yeah. Ooh, yeah. Come on, buddy. Kicked you, kicked you. Ooh, he got me. I don't know what's going on with that guy up there. Attack, attack, attack. Got him. He's tough. Ooh, I got to jump attack him. I think I would play this one a little bit. Okay, so that is that one. Pretty neat. Staying in the collection. And then Frogger. Turn off the sound. Okay. This one is, let's see, 1981. Wow. Oh, 1998 Hasbro. Okay, so 81 is the original trademark. And then 1998 is probably when this game was made. Let's see, so you have game, new, sound, high score, pause. Game, new. Oh, there we are. There we go. Starting, I have four. Time, 32. And start. Okay, so there I am. Can I get across? Oh, no, I can't. Do it again. It's almost hard to see which way things are going. Oh, I didn't go forward. I went left. Hmm. Not fair. Oh, yes. I ran right into a vehicle. Okay, here we go. Got it. I made it across. At least can do one for you. 
Ah, oh, yes, two. All right. So what do you think? Do you want to see the rest of this collection? Do you like them one by one or do you like them in groups? I'm going to put up a poll. I really need to know. Ooh, the batteries came out of this one. I've said I'd bring it back, but uh, I'm just not sure. Not sure what to do. But this is a nice collection. Would you think uh, pretty good? I think. Now I'm going to estimate because I bought a bunch of other stuff. But I probably paid about a dollar each. Which I would say is pretty good for this little collection. Would you agree? Would you pass it up for a dollar each? Especially one like this one. I think one of my favorites out of all of them. It's just neat how this one works. So let me know. And thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. I had fun checking out all these handheld games. I'm going to put up a poll. I really want to fine tune with what you want to see. I know everybody wants to see makers. Well, actually, let me rephrase that. The last time I put up a community tab poll, 53% of the people wanted to see makers. So it's hard for me to decide. That means everybody else wants to see all the other stuff that I do. Let me know. Take those polls. And thanks for watching. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up.